Well, now what we have here is a big box, and um, if you look at my previous videos that I've uploaded, you will see one of my cinema room, of which there were two BMW 800 ASW subwoofers. Uh, consequently, those subwoofers were about 13, 14 years old, so I decided to upgrade the subs, and in doing so, found out the price of these subwoofers was horrendously expensive. If you're talking like the Pardon or the BMWs themselves, you're talking three, four thousand pounds, and uh, that's just freakish sort of money. Whereas if you go ahead and build your own subs, you can do it for a quarter of the cost or less. And uh, this is what this box here is. Uh, I didn't have the time to make my own subwoofer boxes, though I could have done. Um, got a guy off uh, eBay to do them and uh, they have arrived and uh, of which there are two. This is one box here that hasn't been opened so without further ado let's go ahead and uh, start opening this box. So Sharp knife makes light work. See, there is a trusty subwoofer box. You sort of chamfer to the edges, and um, he's also filled it in. Uh, and you can see the recess. Also, uh, you can see in there it is braced. And also, it is also lined with resin. I asked them to put resin in it. They give it a bit of togetherness so that it doesn't uh, come apart. But as you can see, that is a good subwoofer box. Very, very pleased with that. Uh, there is the back of it. <sighs> and there's two holes for the terminals. Which is an excellent job, indeed. So, let's let me get this back. So I'll know. Good job. We well, have speaker terminals. I just got these speaker terminals, thought they'd be better. Insert those myself. 
should be a good job. Right, I have two Kerman Vegas CV5000s coming and I have two SP415 drive units, the 15 inch FI SP415 and the recess around here I just went 5mm that's 25mm front baffle sorry 50 front baffle and 25mm all round sides in the back so I hope you like that unboxing of this sub box and as time goes on and progresses I will add the components to it and this here is all going to be sanded down and painted and then possibly maybe even fibre wrap it so should look well when it's done and also there's going to be rubber feet for the bottoms so thank you very much and bye